Alright, yeah, welcome back to some more Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. So, what quests are we currently doing? I'm going to do the Wild at Heart quest. While muddling around the well-shaded village of Black Bar, Geralt happened across a notice. It stated a hunter named Nalen was looking for any help he could get, get in finding his wife, who had disappeared in the nearby woods a few days earlier. Geralt, already deep in a search to re and rescue Vane, decided to help find the woman. Okay, so we're going to be asking the neighbours about this woman, see if we can get any uh, information on that. You could also do the signs uh, to find out where she is as well using our witcher senses, but we'll ask around town first so we can get a good idea of where we want to be looking. So, seems to be one up here. Hello, Glenna. Greetings, you Glenna. Hi. The gristle and marrow is all I'm willing to sell, and you'll have to wait till I'm done carving it. You the butcher's wife? Butcher? Please. Might have called him a butcher when we lived in the shade of Novigrad's walls. Now he deals in carrion, fallen animals, their bones still fit for soup. So, buying something? Uh, no. Wanted to talk to you about Hannah. Hear you were friendly. She come by at times? We talk? She seems strange lately. Any idea where she might have gone? Hmm. Strange. No? A cheerful soul always. If I'm to judge, it's the wolves got her. Been howling the nights through lately. Even the Baron's men are feared to come by. Hannah must have gone to the wood to gather mushrooms, maybe. Strayed too deep and the howlers got her. Ooh, interesting. Okay. Thanks. Farewell. That leads us pretty much into the woods with that kind of information. We we'll still keep talking around though, so we can get a better idea. They know something's up. Wow! My dad used to make swords like yours. Can I touch it? It's sharp. Better not. Need to talk to your father. I forged swords once. Now it's sides and O's. For good arms, you'll need to go to Novigrad. Wanted to ask you about Hannah. Heard she looked after your children. Aunt Hannah? Do you know where she is? No, that's why I'm here. She maybe tell you where she was going, or anything else? Mm. She said turnips are healthy, and we ought to eat them. I saw her go to the forest, with another lady. It was dawn almost. I'd gone out so I wouldn't wet the pallet. The forest? She's done for. Why? A huge pack roams the area. None from the village dares go in the forest. Neelan's only one not afeared, but then he's a hunter. Hmm. Did you get a good look at the other woman? Know who it was? No. She walked in front of Aunt Hannah. I couldn't see. Somebody led her into the forest where there are known wolves and she went with them. Thanks. Farewell. Well, it's time to go check the forest then, isn't it? I'd imagine we're going to see two sets of footprints then. That's what you would expect anyway. Doubt we're going to get any signs from here. We do have some noises over in that direction though. Oh. Is that just the does? Or is that wolves? Oh. Neckers. Interesting. Do we have any information on Neckers? Bestiary. I'm gathering that we don't, because we haven't fought them yet. No. Alright, we'll take them on. Hopefully we'll get some information on them later. Well, a silver sword seems to be taking care of them just fine. Oh, that was a waste of a uh, coin sign there. Oh, oh dear. Oh. Good, good Igni seemed effective there. Oh, we got one more. Oh. <laughs> can we, uh... Oh, we can quen you out the floor. Good. 
one, so dodgy, dodgy little cell. There we go. I don't suppose that's added to our bestiary. I guess maybe we have to find some information. Ooh, lesser blue mutagen. We'll have to check that. And a green one. Interesting. Because we do have, on our character, we need red or orange ones actually, so these ones aren't really going to work. We can just use them for the powers that they hold though. Sign intensity, extra health, more health, more health. Alright, well. Doesn't seem to really matter all that much. Unless that one's a... Uh, no. Same thing. Alright, cool. We got stuff to sell then, I guess. Oh, more knackers. Yep. And he's gone. That was a terrible sneaky... Sneaky little knacker. <laughs> now he's in the walls. Oh, you messed with the wrong witcher. Solid drop. Good job we spotted that. Is that a goat? Or a sheep? Ooh. Hey, house. Nice. Did wonder why there was a uh, potentially domesticated farm animal out in the middle of nowhere. It's Princess. Alright. Potion seller. Hello. You're not going to let me in, are you? <laughs> Maybe I can igni him through the wall. Eh, we'll leave him to it. We can't get in just yet. Galandine. Nice. We should probably look into our alchemy, actually, and see if we can produce any potions that might be... Hmm. Where's our um, swallow potion thing gone? We should have that, right? This is in good decoctions. Doubt it. Hmm. Interesting. Well, let's carry on. Not much farther to go. She definitely came out a bit too far for her own good though. Ooh, honeysuckle. Yeah, it looks like we're here. There be wolves. That's a dead doe. Alright then. Probably when. And then get out our Igni. These guys are going to pounce in at any moment. Gotta be aware of their leaps. Leap and Gwen. No, not quite. Not quite. Igni. <laughs> Easy peasy. Oh, damn it. Went for a heavy attack, they got the jump on me. Not too bad though. Witcher? What are you doing here? Shouldn't be in the forest alone. I came to tell you. You needn't look for Hannah. She'd have returned long past were she alive. I'll pay you twice Neilan's pledge. Just tell a man his Hannah's dead. Don't want to know what happened to her? I've no illusions, Witcher. In Velen, you're gone as long as she's been. You don't come back. Hannah's dead for certain. Neelan ought to accept his loss. Move on with his life. Now, I've uh, I've got a Witcher code to abide by, so I'm going to be doing the job that I've been tasked to do. And make sure I get paid for it. Strange. People usually prefer to know the fate of their loved ones, whatever the cost. 
What good will it do? I'll not get my sister back. And Neelan's all I got left. Bad attitude, woman. I can't lose him too. And, well, he'll not rest till he avenges his Hanner, even if it eats up his life. The man deserves better. He deserves to know. Sorry, not in the habit of leaving jobs undone. Folks speak true about you witchers. You're heartless beasts. What about you? You want to lie to him? I want to expose the truth. That's what a good man does, even if it's not agreed by most people. Alright, let's see if we can find some tracks. Hello. Mm, no man did this. Hmm. Cuts. Made with long claws. Flesh torn clear off. <laughs> Step away from the corpse. This is getting interesting. Claw marks. Deep. Interesting. Smell of must be corpse. Blood spattered all around. Literally. Werewolf. No doubt about it. Gotta be careful. Find the werewolf's lair using your witcher senses. Alright. Our first werewolf. Blood and paw marks. Wonder where they lead. They seem to lead into this rock. Wow. Shit. Climbed the tree. I can't get up there. Maybe find something else on the ground. Hmm. So we got something over here. Tuft of fur. Ugh. Whatever lost it hasn't bathed in a while. Oh. Oh, well, that's not a... That's not a thing. We've got a scent to follow. Yay. All right. We get to follow the wet dog smell. Wherever it may lead. So I wonder if Hannah's actually the werewolf. That would be an interesting twist. I think that's just a bear. Probably not what we're looking for. Or maybe it is, actually. The uh, scent seems to lead in this direction. We've got some inspection. Man's to do. clothes. Shredded, but no sign of blood. Who rips their own clothes off? Leaves them in the woods. Nudists. Just saying. Nope, there we are. That's a bit more alert. No, maybe you don't want to let me inspect that. Looks like a hunter's quarters. Is that a bear? It looks like a bear. I'm gonna quen up and then take this bear on. Maybe it's a werebear. I don't know. Is that a thing in the Witcher universe? Yeah! Whoa! <laughs> Let's get some uh, damage over time on there. We do need to get our Quen back on though, because these guys are going to hit hard. And probably out of nowhere. Oh, like that. Just keep behind him and he can't really attack us in a way that I can't anticipate. One last signal. Yeah. Sweet. Alright. Give me bear loot. I, I said put it away. Thank you. Alright. Well. Oh, no. I don't want to fast travel. Let's have a knock on the door then, shall we? Oh, oh maybe not. Geralt. Very rude of you. 
walking into a property. Geralt, stop being so rude and looting this poor man's house or lady's house. Doesn't really matter, you're looting away. It's not me, guys, I swear. It's not occupied anyway, so you won't need it. Alchemist powder. That sounds like a useful little bit of thing. Ooh, crossbow. And exploding bolts. Well, I am glad that I looted the area. Have a look at this crossbow then, shall we? Five to seven damage. Uh, let's compare it. Yeah, it's just strictly better by the looks of things. Let's get it on there. And what's in here? Locked. Ooh. Notes. Wonder whose. I am who I am. I can't change that. Shirts woven of parsley and potions made of virgin's tears might work in old wives' tales, but not for me. It is time to come to terms with it. With Hannah's love and iron discipline, I have found a way to manage, but I must remember to hide in the woods before the full moon rises, to go somewhere far from the others, far from Hannah. The attack comes when and then passes. I wake up with wounds on my hands and the taste of blood in my mouth. Perhaps it's for the best that I don't remember. Killing prey with bow and arrow is one thing. To tear it apart with fang and claw. At least here, deep in the woods, I won't hurt any people. Merciful Melitel. Watch over any who stray too close. Ah, the hunter that we spoke of. Seems like he is going to be the werewolf that we speak of. And maybe Hannah came to check on him. And it went horribly wrong. That is unfortunate. Okay. Still need to find the lair. There is an indication of a cave entrance around here, so maybe. Ah, there we go. Go underneath. Destroying objects. Some objects can be destroyed, such as objects marked with the Ard sign, I'm assuming. To destroy objects, to open up a path, face them, and cast the Ard sign. You can also try hacking at them with your sword, but note, not everything can be destroyed in this manner. Another option is to toss grape shot bombs at the object, but be careful not to get hurt in the explosion. Alright. We've got ourselves some blood. Hmm. Blood's just barely dried. He was dragged here. Wonder where from. Let's get some Ard on there. Bush. Screw you, da. Don't need you. Okay. Let's try it carefully around here because I'm not entirely sure how to fight werewolves. And I don't think. I'll just quickly check, but I'm pretty sure we don't have werewolves in our list. And we now have Neckers, Northern Wind Bombs, and Ogroid Oil. Alright. But yeah, we don't have anything on werewolves. I get the feeling that fire would work on them, though. Considering they're quite furry. Search the lair and wait for nightfall. Alright. Well. Let's certainly search the lair. I think we've figured out that they're not here right now. Oh, that's a prize winning cow. Wolf Spain. That's. That sounds like a uh, an ingredient for something to do with werewolves, does it not? Maybe. Oh. I think that's just the. Uh, just the bear that we've got to kill. Seems to be a chest up here. Hunting gauntlets. Let's have a gander at those. Oh, wrong one. So it's an armor up, but we lose 1% resistance. Uh, we lose 2% resistance to elemental damage, but gain it in slashing and bludgeoning. Yeah, 
I guess we'll wear them. The armor up should probably compensate for the 1%. Let's wait for nightfall then. I guess we'll meditate. Until nightfall. Oh. Oh god. Uh, Quen. Right now. And he's got wolf friends. Oh my god. Alright, let's get a dumpling down us. We forgot to have our lunch. That did barely anything. That crossbow on there as well. I need that Quen sign. It's a bit dark in here. Jesus. I kind of want to focus on the wolves, guys. Thank you. Get in and dodge. Just watch out for the, the pouncing of the wolves. We also need to dodge out of that corner. Do not want to get cornered by these guys. Ow. Oh, that did a fair bit. Whoop. Ow. Get my coin on. So we can stop taking silly little hits like that. So I wonder if that woman uh, was telling us to not look for this werewolf because she knew who the werewolf was. Come on, give me that igni. Like you were getting riled up then. He's healing. Oh dear. We definitely need to get the uh, the igni on there then. Counter that health regen. Ow! Every time I put that shield on, straight away I get hit. Good job they've got this dumpling though. Bugger. Oh! He got me. Come back here. Ow. Not to self. Don't dodge into an attack. Uh, let's get some coin on. Back to Igni. Gaining so much life. Definitely need to make sure that we're constantly getting any damage on him. So otherwise he regens health too fast. And pretty soon, like what I can tell at the, mo uh, the uh, left hand side, our weapons are going to get degraded and we're not going to win this fight. Come on. So let's check um, our inventory. Do we have anything we can use here? That's a steel sword. This is the problem. We don't. We've got oils, but I don't think they're going to be uh, effective. It's not a necrophage. Uh, let's see. Accelerate stamina regen regeneration. That might be actually quite good. Vitality regeneration. Now let's get uh, some tawny owl on. 
Can I just drink it? Yeah, just consume it. There we go. I don't think there's anything else we can use. Ow. So that's going to mean we can Igni a lot more often. In theory. I don't know if we're actually even making a dent in this guy. His health just comes back so much. Right, let's be sensible. We need health. There we go. I mean, look at him. His health's almost full. We're going to have to come back and rethink this. Up. This is too much. I don't think we've got any alchemy we can do that helps. We can't make any bombs. There's no werewolf decoctions. Cursed oil? That might do it. Makes sense that there'd be a cursed creature. Alright, I need to get out of here. We can't win this. It's just too much. Also could do with uh, getting our weapon repaired as well. Please, for the love of God, Geralt, stop turning around trying to fight with your fists. That was a uh, tire fire of success there. Let's fast travel out if we can and head into town and try to get our weapons repaired. Let's see. Blacksmith. Because we're doing less damage with our broken sword. And we're also not even using any toxins there. He just gets back to full health in like a fraction of a second. It's pretty ridiculous. We're uh, going the wrong way as well. Need to head that direction. I can only assume cursed oil is the correct oil to be using on our sword. That's a child, not a blacksmith. Is he inside? Excuse me, children. Don't mind me. How do we get into your house? Alright. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. That's not a door. Where the hell's a door to his house? Am I blind? Probably, but it shouldn't be this hard to find. Hmm. Ah, there it is. Blended into the wall. Blacksmith, help me. Yo, get up. You got a job to do. Alright, I guess we'll meditate till morning. Maybe he gets up then. Uh, not character, meditation. Ah, oh dear. Ooh, there's some music. Lovely. <laughs> Your father's still not up. Can you do that? Oh no, here he comes. On his way out. Yo. Yeah? Oh, that's Crap, a great special shot. order weapons too. Do politicians murder high class prostitutes? Of course. Hm. Uh, Got this diagram. Think you can forge the weapon? 
want to go to the repair section. 274 to repair everything. Well, might as well. Don't know if we want to uh, craft anything. We are missing silver ingots. But that weapon does significantly more. It is level 12 though, and we are level 3, so that would make a lot of sense. This one's for a level 2 weapon that does 21 more damage, but no armor piercing, which can probably be bad for us. Viper Steel Sword. Chance to poison, that's pretty cool. Level 2, so we can use it. We lose the armor piercing, but I imagine the poison would compensate for that. And experience as well. Okay, so if we get an iron ingot, which you might be able to purchase or make for us. Yep. We might be able to get ourselves a new steel sword. So I did waste a little bit of money uh, repairing the old one, but... We got ourselves a new weapon, so I don't mind. Let's get rid of the Vicavaro blade. Get rid of the old crossbow. We'll keep the elegant stuff. Why not? Uh, sell the hunting boots. If we're not wearing them, it's probably because we don't need them. Give me a weapons repair kit. Have you got any salt, Peter? And silver. Wax. Doesn't look like it. Does have a second map, though. We'll take that. And it's level 13 weapon, level 5 weapon, level 6 weapon. Hmm. Yeah, we'll leave the rest. I'll do for now. What's this? Lead. I see. We've probably got some junk to sell him, though. Um, where's the junk button? I think this one's it, but he won't take any of it. Fair enough. Alright. Farewell. So long. Let's get to our inventory, put on our new steel sword, and it needs itself a rune as well. Sign intensity, chance to stun, chance to freeze, adrenaline point gain, adrenaline point gain. I like the idea of a chance to stun. Hmm. A poisoning, stunning steel sword. Seems pretty solid to me. Hmm. Okay. Let's head on back then. We can now brew a... We've also got a salmon. Blinding bomb. Okay, probably don't want to use that. Cursed oil. It did use wolfsbane as well, so... You know. Might be useful. Right, fast travel point. Set on back, try to take out the werewolf, and then we'll call it an episode at that point. Oop. We took out his wolf friends as well. Hopefully they don't, those don't respawn when we go back down there. Uh, we should probably attach the oil, cursed oil, to our silver sword. Increase our attack power. We can have one of those potions as well to make sure... We're regenerating our signs quick enough. In fact, let's get a Quen sign attached now. Although it's daytime, so I guess we'll probably have to wait again. He might still be here. Who knows? Yep, he's here. Okay. Here we go. I'm really doing much more damage. The heavy attacks certainly do a fair chunk. Ow. Oh my god. Uh, Quen. 
dumpling. We also want our potion on as well. Our tawny oil. Let's consume one, please. Thank you. Ignit. I don't feel like we're really uh, doing the the power that I expected from an upgraded weapon with the oil that should, in theory, be effective against this guy. Not what I meant to do. How does one stop him regenerating? He's at full health again. I hate this. I hate it so much. Every hit takes him back to full health. And one step closer for us to have ourselves a broken weapon. We need to rethink this again. It's just not working. Hmm. Alright, well, I'm probably gonna have a think about this between episodes and we'll come back and we'll we'll figure out what's going on there, because we don't have any information on werewolves in here. So I'm either gonna have to find it elsewhere or I'm gonna have to look it up. Either way, I will come back on this episode with the knowledge required to beat this enemy. But until then, if you did enjoy the content and you want to see more, then be sure to like and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that little bell icon right next to the subscription button and that will give you notifications when I release new videos. I do hope you've enjoyed and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.